and same with Emma and then we're gonna hope that they can just snack their way through Oof, actually now no I don't like the idea of that I don't like the idea of that Um. Do we send Crash with uh, Pepper and Francis? We have some damage, we have heals, we have some utility. Let's get a med kit here. I don't want to give my ammo out here because we're going to need it. And I think we're going to take the scatter gun here. Uh, oh. Knife fighter might be useful against lost. I mean, we can do one step to get him down into range where the weapon will kill. Let's take a grenade here. And Hernandez. Yep, take the ball pop. Nade. Godspeed, all y'all. We will begin the covert action immediately, Commander. The assassin has so much knowledge, we need to whack them soon or we're gonna be in trouble. Speaking of trouble, I haven't seen any chameleon chrysalids and I really don't want to. Okay, training center's ready. Nice. Commander. This facility will allow our soldiers to train together to improve their bonds, while also putting the knowledge they've gained in combat towards learning new abilities. 90 days to excavate. Okay. Oh, right, so huh, we can send in someone to train and they will get extra action points. At and the risk of getting wounded. Natalie is tired, and it's going to be a long time before we can use her anyway. So let's have her train. Uh, we could do some bond training, but I don't think we can do that with a roster in the shape it is right now. Can, however, train some abilities, and we're gonna do that before the next mission. Come on, Ingener. Nice. Put them here. Now, we Avengers have already scanned on that, course. so let's make sure it doesn't expire so we don't lose the scan time. Another AP rounds, that is well needed. The elders know all too well that you approach the refuge of the insidious Templars. Do not assume that their aid will make any difference to your cause. So theoretically, four days here, seven days here, 12 days until the supply drop. We should be able to get this and then the radio relay. The path to enlightenment will not come easily for you. 
Commander, we need to keep an eye out for the chosen sabotage attempts. We don't have any more time to lose. Okay, we have an additional engineer as a reward. Uh, reduce retaliation counter by two weeks. I'm not so worried about that. The retaliation missions are not that that crazy and doing them actually increases our our supplies in the region hive off the grid i feel we had enough chrysalis for a bit counters high alert we will not be concealed again that's not that bad the 191 supplies though are are quite nice counter operations would make that mission easier Scientist and hidden event. So here's the thing. Oh, Messiah's back. Nice. If that hidden event is bad, we're getting the scientist. If not, we're getting the supplies. So we're going to pay to reveal this hidden event. Mox units gains three more units of HP. Yeah, no, we're not doing that. So that's the one we're gonna counter. So this is how I like to use the reveal ability, only when it would influence the decision of which one I'm gonna take. Yep. Setting course for sector nine, Western yes. United States. A seventh scientist would help. Twenty AP on rust buckets. Here we go. Um, heavy duty repair. Ooh. Yeah, we're gonna get all the melee things. We can kinetic strike. Okay, plus two damage to all attack. All strike attacks. And counter strike means we basically get blade storm. Does not require kinetic strike. So hold on. Mm -hmm. Huh? Gains plus one damage from assault servos. This gives us plus 20 aim. Yep, let's take that. Let's take assault servos. Kinetic uh, counter strike and kinetic strike. Heavy duty repair is tempting. But we usually have a tech support with us who can heal Rusty anyway. And we haven't really had a need for it yet. Yet. Okay, let's pick our team. Very difficult. We're gonna take shock. Um, I'm tempted to take echo and demon. This uh, girls need some EXP. It's especially Demon. She's gonna be really strong later on, but we need to get her up to ranks. Because this is very difficult, we're gonna take Old Man and Messiah to carry. 
that means we have shredding from old man from messiah and rust buckets we have salvo we have shoot twice this should be a fairly strong team so let's start with demon here i'm gonna give you trace a run so you can hit gonna be aggressive so we're gonna give you a scale a nanoscale vest you're gonna have a frag we'll see if we give you if we give you a smoke oh actually yeah you're getting plus five aim because if you get her aim high enough then a, we want to swap out the uh, the tracer rounds for like AP or blue screen or something and just do truck tons of damage. Speaking of blue screens, why have I not built any blue screens? What, why, where are my blue screens at? Oh, we'll look at that after the mission. Also, you should have something with stock. There we go. We swap. Do we have a superior? No, we don't. Okay, old man next. Dragon rounds here. And a smoke. It's the nanoscale. Who needs the extra armor? Realistically, shock. And hmm, it's either demon or messiah. I think demon is gonna be more aggressively positioned, and also would like for her to not be wounded so she can come on the next mission. Messiah. Give you the mag support gun with an advanced stock and extra clip slice. That's perfect. Because you're shredding, you're gonna be among the first to shoot, so we're gonna make sure that you do more damage. Uh, XCOM shirt. Would I put this, this smoke on Echo, I think? Because she can deploy it as a blue action. Let's take Acid and Frost. And let's take a Stock. And Tracers make her like more likely to hit. So we have ammo here, 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 and here, I think, right? Yep. So, Dragon, Tracer, Tracer. AP doesn't matter AP secondaries why can I give does this mean we get a permanent quick chance bonus but not quite sure how that works do we have anything else we want to give you Messiah can we Build an additional vest. No. Do you have anything here that would benefit us right now? Ripjack. We're unlikely to use it. Same with these things. Now I'd rather save these supplies. Well, a mimic beacon, actually. Yeah. Let's grab one of those. Give it to Demon. Are you full? You're full. Echo. You're also full. Old man? You can't be full, right? You are. Okay. Messiah then. Okay. Let's go. Ranger deployed. In position for deployment.
seeking every possible outlet to gain information on the aliens' latest project. And in this case, that means infiltrating one of their facilities to access an exposed terminal connected to their network. Hostile forces will be in position to defend the site, so we'll have to neutralize any threats to lock down the area. Recover whatever you can. We need that data if we're going to stop their progress. Menace 1-5, this is Avenger. The access point we're after is just ahead. Move to secure the area. Expect hostile resistance. Okay, so this was difficult, right? So we're expecting 12. Actually, I'm not sure if it was difficult or very difficult. So 12 or 14. Seems like we should be able to remote hack from what's likely a hole in the wall here. Who's my scout? Robot scout. Seems clear enough. I'm fairly confident coming up here. It's far, but I can reach it. It's unlikely that there's anything in this corner. So that means I'm gonna come it. on this side of this uh, box, whatever that is. Demon, please don't jump through the window. Advancing quickly. Old man. Yep, put you up there. Messiah next to you. Artyom Cool name Gonna get you Behind here Ooh, uh, We should have a healed up rust bucket We should have healed up rust bucket Okay. Sick toyed puppeteer and bog standard snake. Uh, okay. You can't see Rust Bucket in order to repair him, so let's bring him down here. Let's get a repair in on Rust Bucket. Now, I would like for these guys to walk in on us next turn, so that we get to start with a bunch of overwatches. I go as ordered. So, I'm gonna put shock here. I can make it. And hope that they walk in on us. Moving to position. Je me dirige vers les coordonnées. Okay, and then we're just gonna overwatch. Eyes on the prize. These mutons oh. seem a little more agile than the ones we fought in the past. It looks like they're still serving as the aliens' front line, though. Okay, that works for me. Concealed position lost. Oh, come on. Targeting error. Love the green blow, though. No está mal. Ça lui a pas fait grand chose. Oh, 
All right, thank you, uh, Dikata, and good night. Right, so we know we have a mutant pod over here. I'd like to not have to activate them unless necessary. But also, we kind of need to make forward progress, so I'm gonna bring Rust Bucket up here. Moving. If that's an activation, we'll deal with it. If not, we know how far up we can go. Okay. Ideally, oh, that's actually very likely to activate the mutant commando pod. Do I want to do that? Not sure. Possible. I'm taking my blue moves here first to see how far up we can move without activation and I think we're gonna kill this guy and then we're gonna go on overwatch and see if the mutant pod activates and gives us a bunch of overwatch shots on them as well. I'll bring Echo over here. Start over here because she's not gonna have good overwatches on whatever those guys are gonna do. If they walk in. It's still moving! That would be if we hit a 90. Okay. Let's take Messiah then. I'm gonna roll the 77 because she, um Yeah, she can still go into Overwatch after that. Why did you start with so little ammo? Oh, you shot once for overwatch, then once, and you have expanded mag, so you, for some reason, don't get full bullets. I see. Two to three. Uh, this might kill. At any rate, your overwatch is going to be less useful than the others. Actually, we can take a shot here and still overwatch. Okay. Let's bring Artyom closer. I don't think I've had a Russian voiceover previously. They're pretty nice. Okay. Yep, as expected. Nice. The shred. Trajectory failure. That's a lot of armor. Okay. So that's four out of a potential fourteen. We're not gonna have a chosen. Now I think both of these have blast padding. Is that correct? You have blast padding. You have blast padding. Okay. So, given that we've already seen two pods, I feel fairly okay coming out here. That's not shredding. Uh, flanking. How is neither of these flanking? Oh, there must be some kind of rubbish thing here that's preventing that from being flanking. I see. I mean, we could likely destroy all the cover here to deal with the wiper. Uh, what's the plan on the commando then? Blinding protocol disables the grenade. He would have 60 aim. Shooting into low cover, meaning he's going to have 40% chance to hit. Unless we suppress in addition to uh, the aid protocol, in which case that's going to be down to 20. I'm okay with that. 20 no grenades. So let's 
dart on the wiper. I was expecting that to shred, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. So if we use the overdrive, we get to shoot once and then reload. So that's not gonna help us this turn. I'd rather use it next turn. Oh, that's exactly not what I wanted to do. Okay, come on, shred. Failed to engage target. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you did. Oh, wait, we might not have enough ammo for a suppression. Unless we do a zone suppress, which we can do. That means, however, that we're gonna be shooting into six armor over here. How are we gonna deal with that? Is this where a teamwork rust buckets? No, because he doesn't have ammo to shoot. Um, old man, you actually have shredding because of uh, the ability we took. So let's stick to the plan. Let's blind up here. Let's try to hit this 80. Oh, two shredding? I take that. Um, there's a high probability we're not killing the Viper. So I'm gonna disable the weapon. So either he stays flanked and shoots or he moves and reloads. What is with these misses? Um, I mean, we also have the frost bomb option. But, like, we're starting to get to the point where I'm expecting to see Berserker Omega start showing up, so... Not that excited about using it already. Um... Ooh. We would likely have a better shot from here. The high ground advantage. And we're going to take that. Yeah, 92. Now we're talking. Unfortunately, uh, that's going to go straight into armor. If we shoot here.